Well, a truck route through the city of Marquette and Marquette Township brought both commissions together today. They're looking for answers on how to handle the increase in semis from the Rio Tinto mine in northern Marquette County. TV6's Beth Cephalou is at the gathering and tells us with no road in plan for the new option, it's time to plan ahead. Seven years and $20 million later, the Environmental Protection Agency put the brakes on permits to create County Road 595. The big rigs would have run between Rio Tinto's mine in northern Market County and the Humboldt Processing Mill. One of their biggest concerns was environment, and that's why they uh, turned it down. Going through the city of Marquette and Marquette Township, trucks will travel triple the distance. Marquette city officials say the increased truck traffic will damage roads, force the city to upgrade the truck route, and possibly delay planned road construction projects of four and a half million dollars through 2020. We would have to upgrade it, and for us to upgrade it, it would probably cost us around minimum six million dollars. Marquette city officials decided today to hire an outside attorney to work on a public and private bypass, road improvement negotiations, update the current city truck route, and tie in the current truck ordinance. Rio Tinto will be making 50 trips a day, or 36,500 trips in a year, right through the intersection of Sugarloaf Avenue and Wright Street. NMU representatives say this poses a big concern about the safety of their students. At class change time, which is about 10 minutes between classes, we have a significant amount of vehicle traffic as well as pedestrian traffic crossing the intersection. We now look forward to working with local communities to upgrade existing roads and particularly with the city of Marquette to provide uh, improvements within the city or potentially safety improvements as that planning process progresses. Rio Tinto says they expect to have trucks rolling by 2014. Beth Cephalou, TV6 News, Marquette.